Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when you're unable to install the scheme that is Kiwi 5062660 because of this error code that is 0x800703.06. So the first step is to pause and restart the update. So go to Windows Update and over here you can see pause option, hit pause. And this process may take some time. And once this is done, now click on resume updates. So pause and resume the updates and then check if that does not work, the next step is to start app readiness service. Now for this type in services in Windows search box and then click on services. And here you can see app readiness, make a double click on app readiness service and then set this to automatic. Click on apply, click on start if highlighted and then click on OK. Now update your Windows 11. Still not working. The next step is to restart Windows update and background intelligent transfer service for this type uh, search. Windows update over here, make a double click on Windows update, set this to automatic, click on apply, click on start if highlighted, then click on OK. With this selected, make a right click, click on restart. Now once done, now find background intelligent transfer service, uh, make a right click on background intelligent transfer service, make a double click, set this to automatic first and then hit apply. Click on start if highlighted, then click on OK. With this selected, make a right click and then click on restart. And then you can check. Now still not working. Now the next step is to use Microsoft Update Catalog. Now for this, copy this link. The link is provided in the video description. Open this link in a browser. It will take you to Microsoft website. Over here, write down the name of the update. That is KV5062660 over here. Now, once you search it, now over here you can see Windows 11 version 24H2X64 base system. You can check what kind of system you have. You can go to system, go to about option. And then over here you can see 64-bit operating system in my case. So Windows 11 version 24H2X64. Now click on download. And then on this screen you will see the update that is KV5062660 over here. This is the update KB5062660. Now click on it. Download this file. And once this download is complete, you have to click on this file and then you can install this update manually and then restart your computer and then check. Still not working, then use option fix problems using Windows Update. Now for this open Windows settings, go to Windows Update, go to advanced option over here. Here scroll down click on recovery option and then here you can see the option which says fix problems using windows update this will reinstall your current version of windows your apps files and settings will be preserved now click on reinstall now and once the reinstall is done you can check this process will take some time now still not working the next step is to reset windows update components now for this copy all these commands these commands are provided in the video description so copy this copy till here and then open notepad on your computer and then paste all the command over here go to file save as and then you can set the location as desktop and then name this file as wufix.bat and then for save as type select all files click on save now go to desktop here you can see this wufix file make a right click and then click on run as administrator click on yes to allow now, first of all, it will stop all the Windows update services and then it will run some scans. Now, if you receive a prompt uh, to continue, type in Y and then hit the enter key. So it will run a couple of scans. There are multiple scans. The scan process will take some time. And once the scan is all the scans are complete, it will restart all the Windows update services. And once this is done, it will close automatically or you can close it and then restart your computer and after the system restart you can update still not working the last step is to use media creation tool now for this copy this link the link is provided in the video description open this link in a browser it will take you to microsoft website on this website scroll down here you can see media creation tool click on download now and then 
once the download is complete uh, you run this exe file now when you run this exe file uh, you will see this screen uh, click on accept over here and then by default windows 11 would be selected click on next select iso file over here click on next you can save it to desktop and then click on save let the download complete this process will take some time and then click on finish option and let it automatically you know let it close do not close this manually and then go to desktop make a double click on windows iso file run this setup file make a double click and then run this file click on yes to allow and then click on next click on accept here you can see ready to install by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked when this is checked you will not lose any data on the computer so make sure this is checked and then click on install after the installation log into the computer and then update so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to install this update successfully on your windows 11 computer so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel